What's up, crypto fam? Welcome back to another episode. If you guys are new here, we do a giveaway at the beginning of every single episode. And this week's winner is Jacques Lorenz. Thanks so much for commenting on the previous video, Jacques. And congratulations, I just sent you some crypto. If you guys wanna win on the next video, like, comment, and subscribe on this video having to do with the review that I'm about to dive into. Today's review is about a platform called TauTau. The way that it works is underutilized GPUs and CPUs around the world can effectively be tokenized with the TauTau token. If I have a GPU laying around as a cryptocurrency miner myself, maybe I wanna put one towards academia or an industry firm that's doing artificial intelligence and machine learning. I have a competitive edge here because one of my friends works at Apple in the machine learning and artificial intelligence department. I actually emailed him about this and spoke to him about how this would work at scale. And he said that this is a very complex problem. And when you need to work on training models and machine learning and artificial intelligence, you need a lot of computing power. So effectively this platform is matching people with extra resources, extra GPUs, extra CPUs with people that need them. Like for example, my friend at Apple, they have thousands of servers that are running constantly 24 seven. So he said that the problem was a big audacious one to solve, which I'm attracted to always in this space because if you have a problem that you need to solve, why not make it one of the biggest ones out there? So without further ado, I want to review their website, go over the team traction and brief over their technology. So you guys get a chance to check them out and see what they're all about. So let's dive in. After talking to my friend that works in Apple on the machine learning side of things, he said that this is actually a legitimate problem that is needed to be solved because a lot of people have CPU, GPUs laying around that can be utilized to help out. So the problem is existing CPU-based data centers have not effectively evolved with the rise of artificial intelligence, video rendering, and streaming analytics. Our solution, tapping into underutilized computing resources worldwide, blockchain-based data processing services on the TauTau platform. The three main features that TauTau is offering is processing power, memory capabilities, and efficiency. So GPUs can be up to 10 times more efficient than GPUs, very similar to how I you know, use my five mining rigs with 40 GPU graphics cards on there that is much more efficient than having 100 computers or however many computers it would take to be the equivalent of that. So it's just kind of the what you need to solve a bunch of equations quickly. GPUs are much more efficient. Their ecosystem is pretty straightforward. It's through payments with their token uh, where you can actually buy and sell computational output. So, you know, if I have my GPUs laying around, I can actually monetize that using the TauTau tokens. And with staking, they are going to allow you to stake using their node and validators. So you probably have to sign up through their website and through the team to you know, be a validator. I do really like that they added the differentiators right on the homepage. That's something that a lot of companies aren't doing because it's a little bit putting yourself out there as to different you know parameters that people could potentially copy. But I like that they're upfront. High level vision is effectively making this eco-friendly, which I do agree with because it is essentially recycling how people use their GPUs. Um, and you know, it is kind of through tokenizing current GPUs that I have in my house. There is a lot of underutilized computing power out there uh, for AI specifically. So I completely agree with this. And my friend at Apple Machine Learning, he agreed that there is a lot of room. Uh, it is a complex problem to solve. The final one here uh, for their vision is uh, a pretty bold statement. So replace non-value cryptocurrency mining with actual tasks someone needs democratizing and commoditizing computing. So I don't necessarily agree entirely with uh, non-value cryptocurrency mining. Maybe they're talking about specific coins, maybe like older coins that aren't profitable or something like that. I do think as a miner myself that uh, that's a bold statement on their end that, you know, that it is kind of placing AI and, and machine learning for academia and different firms and industries over cryptocurrency and the uh, the value behind that of mining that so i do kind of uh, wonder about that last one but i am a firm believer in the fact that you can recycle this is kind of incentivizing people to recycle their gpus so it's not wasting uh, all the computational power i love the fact that you can tokenize it you can make money 
off of your GPUs that are laying around. And I love the fact that it's helping out academia, is that people that are uh, you know, heavily in machine learning and AI are often in academia right now. And I think that this is going to be something that they could definitely leverage. And they would like to, because everybody likes being a little eco-friendly. They do have five co-founders, and that is a unique perspective here because each one of them, I looked at all their LinkedIn's and they all come with a different background. And I feel like a lot of it is in machine learning. A lot of it is in very legitimate uh, industry background, which I love that. But one big portion here uh, that I wanted to point out is that 90% of the team are engineering uh, with their backgrounds, which I think is very notable. Uh, when you're looking for investments, Andreessen Horowitz, uh, Sequoia, all the big firms out here in Silicon Valley always kind of say, if you're investing in a project that's early on, look at the team first. If they can go through the ringer, if they can build amazing things, the investment is a higher probability of success if they can actually build and execute. So with everyone having an engineering focused background and data science um, and just sort of overall technical backgrounds, I feel like that is a very comfortable place to start. Out of their board was the Decentraland advisor. So I'm a fan of Decentraland with Mana and a lot of people uh, in the community here are big fans of Mana and Decentraland. So I was excited to see that. I like seeing an advisor that is helping them out uh, as well as Tao Tao. I really Really like the overlap there. Uh, that, that's exciting to me. Really quickly over the roadmap here, January 2019 is when the AI beta version is going to be released. So I will follow up with Tao Tao and the team to make sure that you know I get access to that and hopefully we can do a follow-up video on when the beta platform is out there because you know not only do I have GPUs, I know people with GPUs that are interested in potentially monetizing them, especially towards something like academia. Uh, renting them out, if you will, for tokens. And this month uh, is the very, very end of their private presale. So uh, it's basically crushed it off of all of the other reviews that I've seen from fellow YouTubers, the people that I talked to on back channels. A lot of people have said that this is virtually almost sold out, uh, which is very exciting. It's almost over, I believe. And I'm going to put a link to that below. But what I wanted to point out here was that January 2019 is when the AI beta platform is being released. So I'm going to try and do a follow up on that. That is it for this review of Tao Tao. Overall, my opinion is strong on this one. I do feel like there is a massive need based on talking to my friend who works at Apple in the machine learning department. I do feel like there is a big hole in the market here. There is the ability to tokenize GPUs that are laying around. There's the ability for me to actually help people while making money off of it using the token uh, that they provide. So they are currently doing a private pre-sale from what I understand. So I'm gonna put the links to that below in the description. This video is sponsored by Tao Tao. I'm very passionate about helping people in academia solve problems and definitely, definitely, definitely about developing different types of income streams, especially in cryptocurrency. And I do feel like as a miner, this is something that can kind of coincide with miners. So if you guys are watching this and you're a miner, let me know in the comment section below what you think about almost renting out your GPUs to something like machine learning and what your thoughts are there. Don't forget to slap a like if you like this review and I will see you guys next time.